Hey, this is Greg Gilbert, a.k.a. the Python Hyena, host of Python's Paradise. And uh, this is a little different for me. I never shot one of these in my car before, but uh, I just got done cleaning one location, and I've still got three more to do. And I'll tell you, I'm exhausted. Anyway, I must do my officials. I'm a co-producer on 13 Fanboy and victim no more. Yeah, I wear the hat to wear, or the beanie to work, because it's badass. And I got a nice trailer park boy shirt on today, see? You got Ju Julian, Ricky, Bubbles. Looks really professional when I'm at work, but I don't, I don't give a shit. Anyway, um, there was some mail for me before uh, I left. I was going to stick it back in my apartment, but I'm like, when I got done work last night, because, again, I'm, I'm filling in for people not doing their jobs. I'm what you call the buffer. And uh, so I was doing some cleaning last night, and I got back to my apartment at... Uh, Right around 6 in the morning. And if you can look at me right now, yes, I look exhausted. I got one building done tonight because somebody had to go to the hospital. And I've got three more left. Frightmare in the Falls cannot come fast enough. Sad thing is that week in Toronto is probably going to go too fast. But anyway, I got this waiting for me. Uh, it's from Triple Seven Studios, New York. I, I'm gonna be frank. I don't even know what this is. So um, I thought, you know what? I'll just do this in my car. So pictures or posters or something in here. And I thought I would unveil it because I kind of like doing these whenever I'm uh, like this because that way my surprise can be genuine. This is pretty cool. I didn't see this coming. See, I, I um, showed some support to a project called Zoo Crew 2, which is um, about uh, Michael Demetrius, and uh, he's aided with his daughter, um, Lene Demetrius. Uh, he was inspired by the movie The Warriors. And... Um, He's been involved in this project called Zoo Crew 2. Well, and Apache Ramos, who's been on my show three times, and I consider him a friend. He's made me an honorary orphan. I've had David Harris on. i got to get others, but look at this. I don't even know whose names these all are, but look at that. Yeah. It was Apache Ramos that told me about this. And they uh, and Michael and Lene did a Doubtfire Face Challenge for Suicide and Depression Awareness as well. So I want to say a special thank you out to both of them. I tell you, that's a, a father-daughter duo that uh, I love the professionalism out of them, you know. But it says in the back, Greg, thank you so much for your contribution and for your support for us during our early stages. Keep on rocking on the Zoo Crew 2 team. Because I guess it was uh, Zoo Crew 1 when he was growing up. So he was a Zoo Crew 2. Uh, kind of like a gang, but he's not a violent guy. Yeah, Michael Demetrius was what you call one of these tap dancers or whatnot growing up. And it's just he just didn't want to play for the masses. You know, he, he wanted to go his own way. So, uh... Yeah, this was a nice little surprise waiting for me. I didn't know what this was, so uh, this is signed, and I don't even know who all the names are. Everybody signs like doctors. I need to learn how to sign like a doctor. Not that anybody's asking for my signature, but, you know. But, yeah, look at that. That is nice. Special shout-out, Michael Demetrius. And Lene Demetrius from Zoo Crew 2. And Apache Ramos. Love you, man. And David Harris. Zoo Crew 2. Check it out.